take a left uh, 360 for the uh, taking off traffic at Temperador. Terminal traffic, Cessna 402 is taking runway 14 for a northwest departure. Terminal North. Well, it'll be northeast. With northeast, okay. <laughs> Full power. Right rudder. I know, try to get us out where we can get above this cloud deck. I don't know how high it is. It'll be cool it's up there. Alive. And rotate. All right, let's fly runway heading and put the hood on. All right, you got your controls? Yeah. All right, your controls. Okay, I'm got to control. Right, My control. Controls. Temper north here. Can we like come left? Zero six zero. Uh, zero six zero. Temper north. Nice standard left turn there. All right, zero six zero, leveling us out. Uh, blew past it a little bit. There we go. Fast traffic comes away at this time, one four thousand. And you said uh, we're going to two thousand five hundred. We're going to go to, I don't know what. Okay. I'm trying to get on top of this cloud deck. Oh, roger that. All right. And I'll, I'll see what we go to. I don't know what it'll be. Got that nose a little bit. There we go. Now, Mr. Jim, I could be wrong, but I, is BY 80 miles an hour? Right at, yeah. Okay, just make it, just, just double check it. Got that nose a little bit. There we go. Come right to zero nine zero. All right, zero nine zero. Nice standard turn. Start rolling us out. There we go. All right, zero nine zero. Maintaining uh, a little bit less than VY, but we're finding that happy medium between VX and VY. And got us in level flight. Seven November three zero four, turning final runway three five. Let's come left to 360. All right, 360. There's my standard turn. Nice standard turn. A little bit too steep there. There we go. There's standard turn. Start rolling us out. Okay, partner, we're on a uh, 360 heading. 
Timber North, Turkey, Fresno Sea Whiskey, Alpha cleared, 1-4, Timber North. Right, go ahead and level off at 3,500. 3,500. Right, we're, we're not going to be able to get on top of these. Right, we have to go to 3,500. Let me start reducing my power here. I wouldn't reduce power at all yet. Oh, Use the full power oh, of the engine let me to get accelerate the airplane. Right, right, the right. The sequence you want is pitch, trim, power. Pitch, so trim, power. That's over. it. Pitch, trim, push power. Push the nose over. Push the nose over. Make that go to zero. Gotcha, right. Push, push, push. And roll in a full turn on that trim. A full I turn? You, I don't know what you rolled in. It was this or that. All right, we got traffic right here. Don't let it climb. Don't All let right. it climb. All right. Alright, we are now at 120, so I should start reducing my power now. We have a, we have a KC 135 going below us. Oh, it is? Okay. KC 135 below us? That's weird. They usually stay in the Bravo. But he's clear now. Okay. I got us way off our heading, focusing on the altimeter. Oh, fixating. Get us back to 360. I don't know who had you cutting power to level off. You do that in a turbine airplane, but very, very few pistons do you do that. Got you, roger that. There we go. There's my 120, and I can start reducing my power to we 23. Got it way too low, yeah. yeah. There we go, 20. On about 2350 or There's so. There's 23 right there. And I can pitch my nose up just a little bit. Fine. Okay, look at your airspeed. Yeah, I see that. It's, it's make actually... Make it 120. It's actually dropped. engine just a little bit. Okay. I've got There's an EGT her. over here. We're high enough. We really should lean a little bit here. All right. There's our... Uh, I got my speed back under control here. Let me adjust my pitch. There's my vertical speeds at zero. Seven kilo, four miles to the northwest inbound, Sebastian. Oh, that bumpy right there. Twenty-three fifty. Air speed starting to come back up. Uh, you're at about 2250 on your power right now. I can almost listen to it and tell where it ought to be. There you go. Now, That's it right there, isn't it? Pretty much, yeah. And push forward with your left hand and trim a little bit more and you're going to be good. Remember when you make a trim change, it takes a little while to really see what you've got. Understood. Yes, what leg did you say you were on, sir? Oh, sorry, over the river. Over the river, got it.
I've got his trim pretty good there. Traffic warrior report. 360. 360. We're on a uh, 360 heading and um, to make a. Uh, well, here it comes. There it now, comes. While we're, while we're here, I want you to do me a favor. Watch the compass. Okay. okay? I'm watching and the compass. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just make a little turn. Just watch what happens when I start a turn okay. to the right. You see what it did? Yep. It showed yep. an immediate turn to the left. Immediate, yep. Okay? And it's it's lagging behind, okay? Right. When I roll out, it'll catch up. Uh-huh. Okay? When I go the other way, it'll show the wrong turn. Okay, so that's the thing to remember, it, it, that it's wrong. <laughs> the gotcha. smartest thing you remember is it's wrong. Gotcha. You don't really have to worry about how it's wrong, it's just wrong. All right, your control. Okay, my control is all right. Back to 360. There we are. Okay, partner, we are heading on a 360 heading right now. Jackie 175 Alpha Sierra. Up the west. 415, full stop. Let's see if these things will work. I don't know whether they will or not. Tampa North, Cherokee 175. Well, I can't see them, so I'm going to tell you right now they work. All right, now, just use your turn coordinator. Okay. Use your airspeed. Don't tighten up, okay? If you tighten up, everything goes to hell. Okay. And we're just going to go straight and level. Uh, straight and level, okay. And I'm um, going to keep going north. All right. On north, all right. Now, remember, if you, if you turn right, it makes the numbers bigger. Okay, if you Understood. turn left, it makes them smaller. Okay. I'm going to have you make a turn in a minute, and I'm going to give you a right turn. And what I'm going to have you do is make a standard right turn of 90 degrees. And 90 that's degrees. A 30 second that should be 30 turn. seconds. Okay. Gotcha. So, see, this airplane is not legal for IFR because there's no... There's no uh, digital clock. Or gotcha. That's why I was right yeah. fixing my watch there. Yeah. Okay. So when you're ready, I want you to give me a turn to zero nine zero. To zero nine zero. Okay. Nice. Even. Nice standard even right turn. Okay. Here we go. While you're in the turn, 15 seconds. Glance at your time. Don't turn too fast. Oops. Use your use your turn coordinator and use your altimeter. Keep your scan going, nice and gentle. This is tough. Yes, it is. Okay, there's my standard rate turn there, and it's now been 30 seconds. So I can start leveling this out here. There we go. I lost. Look at that boy nail it. Look at that. Wow. I lost 100 feet, but uh, but yeah, sure enough. It's not easy. No, 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 it's not. All right, we are. Oops, we're climbing there. Okay. There we go. I want you to do the same thing again to the left. I want to go left to 360. All right, left to 360. There's my standard rate right there. There's a little bit of altitude, back pressure. Yeah. A bit of back pressure. About 10 seconds. Actually, a 10 from now. 
out now. Here we go. Get back to level flight. Oh, I way overshot it, didn't I? Alright. Okay, got to turn 30 degrees to the right. That's a 10 second right turn. Alright, so. Two. Three. Hey, Tampa Dodge, Turkey. There we go. Start rolling this out. Clear the active. There we go. Alright, that was 10 seconds there. Tampa North, Moon E78 Victor is on crosswind. There we go. 1 4. I overshot it by just a little bit, not much. I remember, this scale runs backwards, okay? You want to be going north, you need to turn left, not right. It, it, it's backward, you got to shift your brain. Right, 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 do right, it, do right. Do it just a little bit and stop. There we go. Do a little bit and stop. Look at that. That felt good. Yep. Way to do it. Do a little right. bit, stop. Figure it out. Gained a little bit of altitude Remember, there. you're in an emergency situation when you do this. Uh, yes, you certainly are. <laughs> you sure as hell are. <laughs> it's a big time emergency situation. All right, I want to descend and maintain 2,500. Then and maintain 2,500. 278 Victor, downwind for 1 4. Stay on our due north heading. Alright. Maintaining uh, my spare speed. Plan City traffic, Cessna. Use your compass. Cessna 52054. So you're you're turning toward the heading. You have to turn away from it when you're going north. When you're on this compass, you always have to turn away from the heading. You want to go north, you need to be turning left. You're turning exactly the wrong way. You're, daggone it, turn my brain around here, Mark. Really tough. This is really hard. I'm not I'm not gonna gonna say you're you're doing well, but this is just damn tough. Airspeed's getting a little bit high. Airspeed will go up in a descent normally anyway, won't it? Yeah. If you pull the power, the airspeed will go up. Very shallow turn there. Here we go. That felt pretty good. Yep. That's the way to do it, like you just did. And we're losing out to about 700 foot a minute. I don't want to turn right to zero nine or zero. Zero nine or zero, 30 seconds. Whoa. Easy there, Bubba. A little too much of a turn there. You, you cleared down to 2,500, so you need to it's keep your descent going gently. Going around, entering uh, crosswind for one foot. I see you turn. There's my standard rate of turn. Still maintaining 500 foot descent. And three. Plus and there's main 30 main seconds. Main Roll us out. short, so I need to go to the right just a little bit more. There we go, that ought to be good. I 
my power back in to 2350. There's 2350 right there. There we go, that's 2350 mark. Alright, now there's one more thing I'm going to do, partial panel. Yes, sir? That is, I'm going to have you do an unusual attitude recovery. Ah, oh, shit, Mr. Jim. Okay. Now, unusual attitude recovery is partial panel. Remember to use that airspeed indicator. Airspeed and what it's indicating, what it's... Yes, use the trend on the airspeed for right. high and trend. low. That's the word I'm looking for, trend. Use the trend. Okay. All right, your controls. All right. All right, chins down, eyes are closed. Your airplane. My airplane. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I leveled wings. Hey, Reduce that power. Get my wings level. There we are. Level wings. Reducing power. There we go. You don't necessarily have to reduce it now. Uh -huh. Already done the recovery. Get your power set. Now I get my power to back, to, yep, to back to 2350. <laughs> and we are back in level flight. Now you notice I didn't give you as bad an unusual attitude as I do. As you did yesterday? No. Uh, well, the reason is, if you've got all your instruments and you go into the clouds by mistake, that's yes, when you get into the into the unusual attitude. Oh, I get it. Yeah, it makes sense. That does make sense. Okay. All right. If you just have a problem while you're partial panel, the chances are you're gonna, it won't, you'll catch it before it gets too bad. All right, let's do another one. Okay. All right, your controls. Heads down, eyes are closed. Sorry, but traffic, jerky 805. Ooh. Ooh. Your airplane. Ooh, all right. Get our wings that, level. Pull that power. See that airspeed running yeah, up like that? Yeah, it sure is. Pull that power. Wings are Get level. Get those up. Yeah. Got us leveled out. Now power. we're in level flight again. Restore your power. Get back to 2350. All right, we're back at 2350 on the RPM. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Thank that was good. That was really good work. Uh, thank you, sir. All right. Um, uh, we're in Sierra. Sierra. Uh, I guess back to the zero, so zero heading. Yeah, let's go to... Back to east and 090. 090 coming up. Now get us back to 2500 as well. Maintain this airspeed. Nice shallow bank. There we go. Alright, 090. There we are. Five two whiskey, one mile final, runway five, winter haven. Alright, I want to turn right to 180. Alright, right, turn to 180, you got it. Ooh, that was a bump right at the same time. Alright, turn to 180. Looks nice like standard. somebody has got a fairly large airport down here below us. Nice standard. Are we anywhere near Ocala? Well, we're halfway to Ocala. Okay, <laughs> doesn't uh, John Travolta have his own airfield? Yeah, it's... but he's got a big paved strip. This, oh, is, oh. A, this is a dirt a dirt field, but it's a big one. These guys got a big hangar on there. Oh, wow. Okay. All right. Roll us out here to zero, 0180. All right. And I can reduce power a little bit. There we go. 2350. 2350 on the power. I get about 100 feet there. Nice level flight on a 180 heading. All right, partner. 120 MPH. We are in a level flight. And we're going to change that trim just a little bit. But we're still, whoa, we're still climbing. There we go. That's better. Let's come right to about a 210. 
310, okay, so that's, uh, Seven seconds. All right, two one zero, and I'm um, wearing two one zero on here. See if that catches up to it. I'm right on it over here. Wait, see, traffic like it's off just County, a little bit. Five, six, uh, five, four, just right a little bit. Right Turn right a little bit more. Okay, there we are. Out of my wings. Let's see if we can program this GPS to take us to Tampa North. All right, uh, so I'm going to hit the direct two button. Yep. Direct two. Oh, wrong button. X. Can't go in, okay. Oh, I'm going up, going down. Okay. Don't don't stare at that screen. The best way to program it is to get it get it in the field you want. Scan your instruments. Okay, and then uh, and then, and then make the changes and count again. Count clicks even. All right, so there's a uh, Tampa North right there. Enter, enter button. Uh, enter. And enter again. Enter again. And there we, oh, there we are. We're 24, 23 uh, miles away. I've been here before. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can't see anything out there, daggone it. Uh, get this altitude now, back under control. Uh, 2,500 for now. Got it. And Yeah, my power was down. That's what it was. Uh. There's 2,500, and I may now then I drop my nose. Put my airspeed back, back up. I put one spin into it. Speed bumping up there. There we go. Yeah, yeah I can reach. It pays up on a heading indicator. Didn't Twenty-three fifty. Oh yeah, we're way out. So, um, so I need to be on a one eight seven. Is that correct? Two one three. That's your direct. Oh, direct two one three. I see. There's. There's two one. I right, now got a message blinking. Okay, so I pass the message. Says, it's set course, course to 213. So set your course in here to 213. There's 21. So is that 213 right about there? Now if there was no wind, then you'd make this one and that one match. You'd be exactly on. That's the reason they have you do that. But unfortunately, there's two wind. Right there. Yeah, east of the field. Move maneuvering for a right down one to runway 15 of Popkin. I want your altitude. I don't want to get high because we're fixing to get under that yep, uh, 3,000. Yep, right. Gets back to 2,500. I blew past that. Fixating on these uh, heading. Easy low descent. You got a hell of a descent right going right now. There we go. All right. I'll just start. Alright, we're on a uh, two one three track right now.
I got my altitude under control. My airspeed did slow down a little bit, but I know that'll build back up here shortly. Well, if it's a little bit off, it's no big deal either. My uh, heading is off just a little bit. I keep that right. Keep that right rudder pressure going. There we are. Got that back. Vertical speeds at zero. Got my altimeter is set good. Altitude is good. Airspeed is just a little low, but otherwise um, everything's thumbs up. We're right on track. Uh. Nice level Our setting is at 2300. Okay. Maintaining, uh, uh, now it's 212. Okay. There we go. You know why that direct track has changed? Uh, is it because we're just getting closer? Is, is that it? No, it's because the, the unit is actually carrying many decimal places that you can't see. I see, okay. And that heading is a great circle heading. Yes, sir. So you, obviously, in a, it's a kind of a peculiarity on a short flight to see it change. You'll see it change a good bit on a long flight. Okay. Uh, like if you think you're going due west, that, that GPS will take you a little bit to the north and then a little bit to the south, you know, around the Great Circle route. Gotcha, okay. Winter traffic archer, right class, one, two, three, winter heaven. Fox traffic, zero seven, November, going to the right down one, one five, the pop gun. And that's, that's thermals, am I correct? Well, uh, yeah, it's, uh, turbulence. It's, uh, we've got these puffy clouds. So you can think of every one of those puffy clouds as a vacuum cleaner that's sucking air up, spitting it out the top. Okay. And in between, the air goes down. Well, hell, we got a lot of those clouds. We sure do, yeah. So we got ups and downs all over. Is it upsetting your stomach? No, 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 no. Okay. I've, I've got a stomach of steel, I promise you that. Um, uh, that's my trim here. There we go. They're just not comfortable, obviously. And it's even more, you feel them a lot worse uh, on the instruments, too. It feels a lot worse. If you're flying visually, you wouldn't notice these quite so much. No, no, you're right yeah, there. Midfield, right down one one five, five fifth, space short approach. Morning, traffic archer departing the pattern to the northwest, winter heaven. Here's power a little bit, there we go. Back to 2350. Yeah, that uh, these these uh, you know these bumps. Uh, when you get your hand on the throttle, I you know I accidentally put a little bit too much power there, just with yeah. just a little gentle bump. Well, that's why when I'm once I'm in level cruise, I, I go ahead and tighten that friction lock, take my hand off the throttle. Okay, well I got it good and tight. All right. I said this one won't tighten up all the way. Okay. Traffic, take a look and keep your scan going. And take a look at your navigation instruments. What are they telling you? Oh, shit. I'm way the hell off course, that's what. Yeah. There it is. All right, you're turning right. What you did is you omitted your heading I, indicator I sure from did. scan. Yep, I sure did. I was focused on my altitude and uh, vertical speed is what yep. I was staring yep. at. And that's, uh, it's real easy to do. It's real easy if, you, if you're messing with the altitude, it's real easy to, to get uh, tossed off. Right. There we go. 
Okay, I got my heading under control. Our altitude is good. Vertical speed is zero. As I keep going, here, 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 you know, when I, that's what yeah. I keep doing, going back to this, kind of like uh, to the song, Staying Alive, about every one, one yeah. and a half seconds. I want you to give me a right turn to 270. 270, you got 270 coming up. Nice standard turn right there. Start rolling this out right now. There we go. Lost low power there. There we go. 2300. There we go. Remember, if you can't stay okay, on the altitude, really it's better to stay 100 feet high than 100 feet low. Okay. Because there's not anything to hit if you go up. That makes sense. Okay. All right. All right, we're on 270. Get my altitude back under control here. Nice, easy climb. 500 foot a minute. Standing 270. There we go. Now what I'm going to do, I have programmed this thing yes, sir. for a straight in approach to one four. So I'm going to I'm going to vector you out here to the west and, and do a I'm going to do a radar vectored approach into one four. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, we're maintaining two seven zero. My altitude back to twenty five hundred. Add a little bit of power. Air glaze traffic, uh, Skyline 23, uh, 2539 Romeo, 6 miles out on a straight oh. in for 1 3, currently at 1,600. Uh, There's 2,500, so let me start reducing power here. There's 2350. Drop the nose, should come right around to the horizon here, and I should be good to go. Yep, all right. Got a little bit of a clump. There we go, perfect. Got off course about five degrees, there we are. Back on course, airspeed's good. Attitude indicator is showing us level. Turn indicator showing us level. Uh, we have a Glen Manor Alpha. Alpha is about four and a half miles to the south. Going to be maneuvering for the, the right downwind to one five of Popkin. All right, two seven zero. There we go. I should be able to let go and it should fly itself just as smooth as silk, like that. Uh, not. It won't stay smooth long today. <laughs> no, turbulent. no, but uh, but I, I just wanted to yeah. make sure that I had her trimmed no, down that's good. That's exactly the right thing to do. Check your trim like that. When I, when I was working on my instrument rating, yes, sir. my instructor told me, and I have told all my students, if you don't learn anything else when you're studying instruments, you'll learn how to trim an airplane. Uh, yep, I believe that. That's for damn sure. All right. Still maintaining 270. Altitude's good. Airspeed's pretty pretty darn good. Tell me a little bit of a right turn there. There we go. All right. And it did, I was in a turn. I'll get you to turn right to 330. 
All right, turn running, turning right to three three zero. Nice standard turn. There we go. There's my standard turn right there. Three three zero. Oh, three three, not three six zero. Three three zero. Three three zero. Sorry, Mr. Jim. Sorry about right. that. Can't always communicate perfectly. No, um, I, I I heard three three zero. I'm just an idiot. There we go. All right. Uh, on the end of the turn. There we go. Three three zero. And getting us back to level flight again. All right. Airspeed's good, altimeter's good. Vertical speed should be dropping again. Yep, okay, we are good to go right now. All right, we're good on our airspeed, altimeter. Turn indicator zone now is level. Let's turn left to 240. All right, turning left to 240. Nice standard turn. Descend and maintain 2,000. Descend and maintain 2,000. Let me drop power. Standard turn. Five way traffic, 100 Alpha Alpha, turning right base, 15, full stop, Apopka. There's two four zero. So I rolled us out a little too late. There we go. Two thousand RPM. There we go. That's a good descent. Up we traffic one hundred alpha alpha final one five. We'll stop. Up off the four zero. <clears throat> Start bumping that power back in now. Camp on the we go. Sydney, Victor, back texting. All right, two four zero. All right. Two thousand feet. Two four zero. Vertical speed at zero. Oh, uh, I was going to say we were level, but we weren't. All right, now we're level again. Traffic in the site. One three four zero Tango uh, for Tampa North. All right, let's come left to one eight zero. Left to one eight zero. And I want to see you intercept that. Okay, right to that. Giving you a thirty degree intercept. That's standard. That's what the uh, FAA will normally give you is a 30-degree okay. intercept. All right, there's one. one correct, one, three, one eight three, zero three, right there. Traffic for one four. Traffic. Uh, and I need to keep going to one five zero. You're, you're going to intercept it. So you're traveling one eight zero. Yep. Okay. You're supposed to be anyway. Yep. <laughs> and when uh, that meter comes in, you turn and track it inbound. Oh, I see. Okay, I'm with you now. I'm with you. I'm totally with you. Oh, I see it. It's getting closer. It's getting closer. Yep. So whenever I'm centered with it, since it's going this way, do I need to turn now, to the... Start your turn when the, when the needle touches the donut. Start your turn. You, uh, start my turn. You've got time for, uh, on Tampa North. Lost a little bit of altitude there. I'll slow down to extend my downwind. There we go. Sounds good. I'm ready to go. So. Yep, north, seven my altitude two, back under control. There we go. There's one five zero. Uh, I lost a couple Captain hundred north feet traffic, there. Traffic Cessna four zero two is on a ten mile final for runway one four, Tampa North.
Power setting right. Tampa traffic, Cherokee 1340 Tango. Right base for 14 Tampa North. Heading back to 1000. There you go. I see that needle starting to move a little to the right. Yep. That tells you turn maybe two or three degrees to the right. Just a tiny bit. Just a smidge. Tiny little bit. Just That's plenty. A You've way we overdone it now. There we go. You Keep just want to think about getting, getting over there. there. Got you. Okay. I got you. I see that starting to center up. Yeah. There we go. Altitude back. Slow the airplane down to 100 miles an hour. All right. Put it in the white. Reducing power to about 22. Yep. Trim for it. And I'll trim. Pull it back, trim back. Tampa North traffic, Turkey 1340 Tango. Of crosswind for one four with a departure to the north. Tampa North. Alright, airspeed right. altimeter. Now I want you to make a Ready? little power reduction to about two thousand RPM and give us about a five hundred foot per minute descent rate. That's what we're after is a five hundred foot per minute descent okay, rate. Okay, Roger that. Alright, there's uh two thousand no, leave it right there. Let the There's 2,000 RPM. Now. Let, it, let it descend. And that may be, that may be too much power. Uh, we may need to take a little more off. Okay. I think you need to take just a little bit more off. All right. All right. We'll load about 50 off. Uh, take it down to about 1,800. Oh. Probably close to 1,700 is what you're going to want. How's that look right there, partner? I'm at 500 foot a minute right now. Right there, okay. 1,700 RPM gives you 500 feet per minute at about 100 miles an hour. That's your typical instrument approach at okay. speed, okay? Got you, roger that. Tampa North traffic, Cessna 402 is on a five mile final for 14 Tampa North. Keep that going, and I'm going to break you out in a minute. When I break you out, when I say break out, I mean we're in the clouds now, right? So yep. I'm going to, when I pull those foggles off of you, I want you to land straight ahead on runway 14. Yes, sir. Keep your descent right. It's a very subtle thing, but as you descend, the air gets thicker, so the engine power actually increases. So okay. even though you're flying a constant power setting, right. you're still having to move the throttle. Watch I, your heading. Don't give up on your heading. Oh, yep, I got way off there. Let me get back down here. There we go. There we are. Okay. Alright, so we're at a thousand. Oh, we're out of the clouds. Alright. Alright, now you're, you want to be in the white arc, so cut your power. Cut your power, pull the nose up a little bit, and start deploying your flaps. One Mississippi. Have you done straight in approaches much? 
Uh, no, maybe less than less than ten, probably. Yeah. Oh, another set of flaps. One Mississippi. Got twenty degrees of flaps. At Tampa North, just four zero two is on a two mile final for one four Tampa North. Plant City, Plant City traffic, Cessna Skyline, Cessna 52054, four miles south of the airport, entering a crosswind for runway 10. Plant City. Pull your carburetor heat on. Our heat is on. Seven miles to the southeast. I'll right, go ahead and extend my flaps fully. Make sure your mixture's rich. Yep, it's in. Alright, landing Plan legs. We're good, we don't need that on right leg. Avionics. Uh, Alright, we're good, we're just landing now. Flying at 2,000 feet, entering a 45 downwind for runway 10, Plant City. Back center line here. There we go. Touch of power. A little too slow. There we go. We want to land right around 60. Is that correct? We want to approach at 70. Okay. Well, we are at 70 right now. That's perfect. Okay. When you cut your power and flare, we'll touch down at whatever it touched down at. Okay. Right to that. <laughs> all right. All right. If you know what your touchdown speed is, you're looking in the wrong place. Now you probably, if you do it right, you'll touch down around 40. 70 over the numbers. And down to 65, you're at 65, you're at 50. See, that's, that's where you want to be. That was pretty good. Oh. I've never actually looked at the airspeed indicator on landing before. Well, whenever we were uh, coming over the number, we were pretty high, and we had the airport made. We were doing uh, right at 65. Yeah. I haven't even touched the brakes. Guy yeah, has got this uh, exit blocked, so we go down to the go down to the end. Go okay. one and, and turn in. And Roger that. Well, Mr. Jim, thank you for the lesson. It was uh, it was educational to say the least. It's tense, it? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. My mouth is as dry as like I've been out in the desert for a month. <laughs> and trust me, I know what that feels like. <laughs> All right. Tamanor traffic. Cessna four zero two is clear of the active Tamanor. Tamanor traffic. White Cessna back taxi on one four. Tamanor. room over here partner um, now do you want me to put it over uh, you got another student uh, I don't have another student and we do need fuel we do need but you. okay uh, pull it pull it if you can pull it behind Keith and put it where we had it that way they can feel it easily and okay. then uh, then uh, they can push it I'll let them push it back. okay assuming there's room to get through I was gonna there. say can we fit through there is that what do you think? Yeah, we'll go. Oh, yeah, we got that. Yeah. We... All right, you watch me on that side. I got this side here. Hey, you got plenty of room over here. Okay, I got plenty of room over here, too. Oh, yeah. That's good. We're good right here. Just All right. So they can push it back onto the... All right, landing... Uh, after landing... Landing traffic Cessna 5 up. entering a 45 downwind for runway 10, Plant City. 